okay guys now let's start with uh, you know that another uh, how to set the alert on mobile actually mobile users for mainly for mobile users so uh, once you apply my both the indicators on the chart like right so if you want to set the alert you have to go to this settings part first right once you drag down here you will find the seven assets these are the seven assets right if you have bought my 40 indicator 40 uh, alerts indicator you will find this list as 40 alerts right the list will be seven not seven but it will be list will be 40 right settings both are same once you have to click if you want to edit this list you have to click on this pencil symbol which you see in here once you click on that if you want any other asset you can just write a, -A p l e if you want to work on apple right so you can apply whatever you need suppose i need this apple nasdaq listed chart so once you click the chart it will be applied on the chart so you can add uh, you know all the values like for futures as well as uh, you know all the stocks crypto commodity international stocks right whatever you have whatever is there in the trading view you can apply it on here right and once you update the list you have to click on this three dot downside and save as default click on this save as default once you save click on save as default and then click ok right oh, means the alert settings are done now we will set the alerts how to set alerts you can three see here in this alert i uh, means indicator section you are seeing this three dot you have to click on this three dot you will find the first option here add alert on raven screener you have to just click on this uh, option right this window will open what here you have to do you have to just set the, if you have the free account you have to just set this uh, expiration date right uh, you can uh, set minimum two months of data like uh, two months expiration date you can set and if you have a premium or pro users if you have al more alert option you can click on this open ended alert once you click this open ended alert it's currently my account is uh, like you know this uh, premium one so i can set this open ended alert so alert come continuously so if you are a free user you can set till two months so here uh, let's consider your account is uh, free version so you uh, let's set the 11 date i have set this the date from here once clicking on this calendar section you can change the date here right so i have selected this 11 september set after here you have to click set this date once you click and just you have to create this alert right once you create the alert you will your alert will be set if you want to see where the alert has been generated you have to click on this three dot option once you go downside you will find the alert management once you click on alert management you will find here the indicator which you set the alert you will see here the alert right silver one hour chart and this alert has been set uh, if you want to see the alert log what what alerts has triggered per day you have to click on this alert log the whole alert which are triggered on a day it will be shown over here right i hope you are understanding how to read the alert if you are not understanding that you can refer my main video uh, which uh, screener video in that i have mentioned how to read the specific alert when it's triggered uh, the line you have to read by go triggered for specific asset name what should you have selected in this seven list or 40 list okay so i hope it's understand so in some cases like if you want if you have already set this alert and uh, it's on one hour time frame right so uh, whatever time frame you select the alert will be set on that specific time frame if you want alert in five minute time frame example so you have to click the chart switch the chart into five minute time frame you have to see in free trading view account you will get only single alert if you want you know uh, to change the alert you have to go to the alert management right go to the alert management you will find the list right you have to remove that alert as you want five minute alert so one hour alert i am just removing it right this is removed right and now you have to go to the five minute section now three dots as the same process i told first option uh, set the expiration date i am setting here 11 september set set date right so now uh, alert has been set i am just creating so this alert will be set on 5 minute now right you can see once you go to the alert management 
you will see here the silver five minute alert has been created okay so whatever alert will become that is based on five minute time frame okay i hope it's understood now uh, still if you have any confusion you can uh, get my number from the description thank you